Finally, on the news, President Muhammad Buhari declared November the 1st as the National Youth Day, and this was to draw attention and find solutions to the issues that affect the youth and create the needed policies. Theophilus Elama tells us more. In the wake of the NSARS protests, the agitation revealed that youths can cause a change. The protest was against police brutality. The peaceful protest got attention leading to the declaration of 1st of November as National Youth Day. At this local council, the chairman made moves to actualize the president's plans for the youths. All over the world, when you take uh, statistics of the number of uh, the youth, you will discover that uh, in anything we do, the youths are always coming first. They come first in number, they come first in reasoning, they come first in, in, in even contrib contributing to ideas. Guests believe that this will highlight the issues that affect the youths. I believe we will we, we be able to put a lot of control in place to make sure our youth are useful, to make sure that we, we're able to control all those excessiveness of uh, abuse of uh, a lot of uh, all these hard drugs. So I believe with these little things we are doing, and I believe we should be able to control the youth uh, excessiveness. Against the background of the protest we just had that actually shook the country to its foundation. And if you look at it closely or otherwise, you find out the youth in, in all honesty is the future of the country or the future of life itself. So when they begin to agitate and they actually have a thing to complain about, the adult must necessarily respond to that. This is a separate commemoration from the International Youth Day observed every August 12th. International Youth Day is an awareness day designated by the United Nations to draw attention to a given set of cultural and legal issues surrounding the youths. Theophilus Ilama, TVC News, Lagos.